Hi, I'm going to show you how to import a template into your Canvas course today. So the first thing you're going to want to do is to log into Canvas and you can do that in one of two ways. You can come over here and click on the icon that Mark Merrifield was kind enough to place on our intranet page or you can also go through Canvas by going into class link. I'm going to choose the icon. And since I was already on the intranet page, that means I was logged into the OneDrive account. And that being the case, it's going to take you straight into Canvas and you'll be at your dashboard. Now your dashboard is going to look a little different than mine. I have quite a number of different courses in here because I've been sharing courses with a digital learning specialist and also creating courses to play around with to learn some um, of the features of, of Canvas. So there are two ways for you to import a template into your course. One would be to choose one of the courses that you already have in here. Um, and the other way would be to start a new course and create it by scratch. Um, I often actually start a new course when I want to create an opportunity for myself to practice and learn new things and try things out and not have to worry about deleting anything on any of my other courses. Um, it's just a peace of mind thing. So for this example, we're going to start a new course. Click on it and give it a name. I'm actually going to use the name example, which you will type in the box. We're going to leave this as private. Create the course. This is what a shell, a skeleton of a course looks like. There's nothing in it. There wouldn't be anybody in it associated with it except for yourself. What I'm going to do is now go over to the dashboard and see if that course is there. I'm going to scroll down. Oh, there it is. The name of the course that I created was example. Right. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach a template to this particular course. And I've made a template for you for November 2nd in the Canvas Commons. The Canvas Commons is located over here on the left hand side. It's like a C with a little arrow. Click on that. What the Commons actually is is a wonderful place to go where um, people in our district as well as anyone who belongs to Canvas shares courses and um, work that they have done and of giving you permission to go in and use it. So you would click on it, apply it to a course and edit it. So there's a lot of different people that are in here. So to make this easier, we're gonna narrow it down by clicking and typing Merrimack, which happens to come right up. So now I'm, I can see people who have created courses here in our district. I'd like you to go down and choose the TFS elementary template. This is the course that um, the template that I've made for you for November 2nd. Click on the name. All right. What you're looking at is just some details that go along with the template. There, it's not anything that will be in your course it's just some helpful information for you. So keeping that in mind, we're going to go over to the right here underneath the little picture, and I'm going to click on Import Download. What you're going to need to do is assign that template to a course. These are all the courses that I happen to have in my dashboard. The Comp 1, 2, 3, and 4 are, are my rostered PowerSchool courses. You will have courses in yours that are rostered from PowerSchool as well. Yours are going to say something to the effect as your name AM, your name PM, or math, science, reading, social studies. For this example, I'm going to use the course that I created, which was example. I'm going to click on that and import the course. All right, you're going to see um, a green 
banner go across the top of the page that tells you that you have successfully imported, started the import and starting it is the key word. It does take a minute or two sometimes to take effect. So Canvas is going out there, retrieving that template and bringing it back into your account. I'm gonna give it a second. I can go over into the dashboard and check the progress and see if it's there yet. I hadn't published that course, so I'm gonna go down to the bottom. Okay, this is where it is. I should actually see a picture start to form here, and then I'll know that it's ready. Yep, there it goes. All right, I'm gonna click on example so you can see what the course looks like, the template. All right, here is the template, which um, when you actually see this, we'll have a welcome video that I'll be making this evening for you. All right, so this is ready for you to use um, as is, or you could edit it as much or as little as you like by simply clicking on the editing button. But the editing process is going to be in an additional video tutorial to come or some PD time in the lab with me. So hopefully you were successful in importing the template and um, I will see you very soon. Bye.